Hi everyone, it's Dr. Sam here from Southern Cross Vet and I'm here with the beautiful Layla, the tri-coloured Aussie Bulldog and little Arlo. How cute is he? And I'm here to talk to you today because it's going to be a really hot heatwave kind of day today about these squishy faced breeds like little Arlo and Layla here and some of the things that we can do to help them on really hot days and also some things to look out for to see if they're suffering from heat stroke or um, at risk of having a problem. So, um, yeah, brackies are dogs that have little squished in snouts like this. Whoa, Arlo. And at the best of times, they have trouble breathing. If I put Arlo up to the camera here, you can see even at rest, he's a little bit, sounds a little bit congested. And the trouble with dogs is uh, on really hot days, they have difficulty cooling down because the only sweat glands that they have in their body are on their little paws here. And so they can't do what we do, which is called evaporative cooling when it's really hot. We sweat, the sweat evaporates off us and our body temperature drops down. But these guys can't really do that. So a couple of tips on really hot days, apart from the obvious, like leaving water bowls out with lots of ice cubes in them or even freezing their favorite treats like chicken necks or chicken wings in a big ice block and leaving them out in the garden. If you find your dog to be really hot and not coping, there's a, f a few things you can do. So first of all, get a few ice packs like this in the freezer. And if you're noticing that they're distressed on a really hot heat wave day like today, wrap it up in a towel so it doesn't kind of burn their skin and you can apply it Stay with them, keep them calm, apply it to their skin, that can help to cool them down. Another tip that I really like, and it might take some getting used to, I think Layla might like to help me with this one. Come on, Layla. Good girl. Good girl. Have a little portable fan, like one of these ones from Kmart, they're five bucks, and a water bottle. Put the fan on. That sounds funny, guys, doesn't it? And then what you can do is Spray them with water. Is that nice, Dalo, or are you scared? This is your first time doing it. And then just putting the fan on, as you can see, it takes a bit of getting used to. What's that? You like that? Maybe you want a spritz too? On your butt, on your butt. Is that nice, Arlo? And that's probably the fastest way to actually cool them down on a really hot day. Um, I wanted to show you guys also how to check for dehydration, so just stay with me. Hey Layla. So checking what's called the capillary refill time is probably the best way to see if they're starting to suffer from heat stroke or dehydration. So in Wrigley puppies it's hard, but what you do is lift up the lip, have a look at the pink gums, press on the gum until the colour blanches, and count how long it takes for the time to come back. If it's less than two seconds, that's awesome.